Hi everybody. Now I want to show you my prototype of um, gasoline vaporizer. First, I want to show you the uh, um, diagram. It looks like this. This is the uh, just closed container, and this is. Um, gasoline liquid gasoline and this is a um, fuel injector the uh, gasoline will be injected into the uh, container and I have here the uh, electric stove the uh, um, gasoline will be heated um, using this stove and will be vaporized and here um, I have no liquid gasoline and here I have um, air intake valve and here I have um, gasoline vapor out goes to the engine okay now I will show you the actual device this is the uh, normal injector I have the injector here this is the air intake valve so that I can adjust the uh, the fresh air that goes into the uh, container and the uh, gasoline vapor comes out from here goes to the intake of the uh, engine now I will show you the how it looks inside the uh, container I don't know if you can see this that is the uh, uh, residual um, part of gasoline which is uh, I don't know it's, it's uh, very thick um, it is not like oil it is you cannot burn it it is um, um, I don't know what it is it is there in the gasoline so this is um, fresh air comes in here is the uh, liquid um, no not liquid this is uh, from the uh, fuel injector and this is the uh, gasoline out um, gasoline vapor out and here I have my um, electric stove it is powered by um, an invent inverter I have an inverter on my car installed in my car I will just show you how I installed this I have driven my car using only vapor for um, yeah um, the problem is um, that I um, I cannot um, adjust the uh, fuel um, how you call it the uh, the fuel goes into the uh, into the container 
I have used the uh, standard ECU to control that, but uh, it's not um, good. I have changed. I have used so many um, different um, fuel injectors, so many sizes, but I think I have to develop my own um, um, ECU uh, fuel injector controller. Okay. This is my um, fuel um, line. It goes here, and from there, um, the vapor goes here. And this is my intake manifold. And um, And this is my inverter. I just install like this. And this inverter um, gets um, the electricity from my second battery. And this second battery um, is charged by my um, second alternator my original alternator is there it is so small and this one is um, it has a 90 ampere capacity yeah um, I have taken out everything because of the uh, um, um, German inspection. They um, did not accept my <laughs> vapor um, system, so I have to um, take this all out, and then um, I could pass the uh, inspection. So, um, yeah. Basically, I can adjust the uh, intake air um, here and also here for the uh, mixture. This is fresh air and this is um, gasoline vapor. And I uh, can um, turn off my standard injector using a switch from from the cabin this switch I can just cut off the uh, fuel standard fuel injector signal and yeah that's it actually this is my fuel line Just make a T. Goes there. Goes here. And then goes here. To the fuel injector. This is the fuel injector. that and then I can produce um, enough um, vapor from liquid um, gasoline so yeah um, that's it uh, about my gasoline vapor um, setup Um, about the fuel economy I cannot tell anything because um, without um, custom um, ECU I cannot um, get my 
few uh, method correctly. Yeah. And at the moment, I don't have any um, time to develop this further. I don't know if I um, I will develop it further or not. We'll see. Okay. That's it for now. And I will show you again the uh, diagram. This is the diagram. For those uh, who um, is interested with this um, vapor system, I can tell you that this works and the uh, um, exhaust um, gas is very clean. Um, I cannot smell anything from the uh, uh, exhaust so actually this is a very good uh, system okay that's it and bye bye